It's important to get your flu shot not only to protect yourself against the influenza virus, but also to protect those around you. For instance, infants younger than six months of age and some elderly patients are not able to receive it for various reasons. And so you, by getting the flu shot, also provide them with some protection. In addition, the CDC has studies that have shown that the flu vaccine can protect 50 to 60% of the population and prevent them from getting the flu virus. Everyone aged six months and older should get a flu shot. You need to keep in mind that it takes about two weeks from the time you receive the shot until you actually have protection from the shot. So very important to get that vaccine before the peak of flu season. There is a very common myth out there that the flu vaccine can cause the flu. It is impossible for the flu vaccine to give you the flu. The flu vaccine is made of a dead or inactivated virus. It is not a live virus, therefore it cannot give you the viral infection. However, it is important to note that it does cause some common side effects, such as pain, redness, or soreness at the injection site. It can also cause body aches and a low-grade fever. Sometimes these symptoms are mistaken for the beginnings of the flu virus, but again, these are just common side effects. It's very important to take uh, standard precautions against the spread of germs. So if coughing or sneezing, cover your mouth and nose with a tissue and immediately throw that away after usage. Wash your hands frequently with soap and water. If soap and water are not available to you, use an alcohol-based uh, sanitary cleanser. Avoid touching your eyes, nose, or mouth, especially when out in public, because this is how these germs are spread. So flu symptoms usually uh, hit patients pretty abruptly. Um, it'll start with symptoms such as body aches, fevers, and chills. This usually progresses then to cough, sore throat, and runny nose. If you or anyone in your family is experiencing these symptoms, we encourage you to follow up with your family doctor.